All right, welcome back to Western Wild Survival Challenge, episode 51. So I was uh, sitting here looking at some stuff, and I just happened to see that uh, grapes were good this month. Well, I was looking at trying to figure out what we could use for a trailer, and all of a sudden it popped up on the screen, uh, maple syrup in demand. So I thought since we had, you know, 5,000 liters of uh, maple syrup, we'd uh, drag them over here to the maple syrup stand. And most likely we can get rid of all of them and for a good price. Okay, wasn't as good as I thought it would be. Um, let's just quick look again here. Great technology. Yeah, it's 4,700. That's the one I'd rather have. You know, that one's okay. But it's still, you know, it's got a lot more room than the other one. So uh, we're going to go see what else. I think there's something else that sells in May. I don't remember what. I know the grapes do. Let's quick look through at what we got. I, I know this is kind of one of those weird, uh, you know, I need to make money things, but... Uh, the corn does sell okay, but I'd rather get the full 551 for it. Um, when does cotton sell? Way over in February. Eggs are in November. I'm sure silage, yeah, it's January. You know, we could run that up, but that's not really worth all that much. Uh, what about the olive oil? It's next month, so let's just go ahead and sell the olive oil. We've probably got a ton more olive oil. It's probably just waiting to come out. Now, I was going to connect these two fields. Um, and, the, you know, I want that trailer, but at the same time, um, I did look at this. That is the Puma. That is a medium size, uh, if I'm not mistaken, medium. Well, actually, no, I'd say with the horsepower, it's probably a large. I mean, but unfortunately, we don't have enough even for the 94,000 for it, let alone the motor upgrade to get an even higher horsepower. But that's okay. You know, it's no big deal. Well, uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go run that trailer over and then see if there's any more. Oops, I just I reconnected. Um, we may run the, the hay up or the silage, whatever you want to call it. Because it might be worth more because I think we cashed out the silage too early. Okay, and there is quite a bit of, uh, um, of olives in there. In fact, our olive, uh, the factory over there, which is on distribution, is also just about full. I mean, our grapes are almost at 150,000. So, okay, let's see where the olive oil sells at. Um, so if we sell it at the train yard, we got to manually load it over, but at 4,000 a, a thing, you know, well, it's probably not 4,000 a pallet, but per hundred weight or whatever it is, um, might be worth it. And then we're going to come back and grab some more if we don't get to the you know, to the money amount that we want, because what I'm thinking is if we can get that uh, trailer, we can then uh, load up many, many loads of grapes and run them up and sell them and go from there. Now we got to come around the back because we don't want to hit our, uh, our other loader here, so. Okay. Um, unload his eye. There we go. So yeah, I mean, we got to obviously do this the goofy way, but whatever, you know. Wait, wait, wait. What was the... It just uh, started... Uh, 
I wonder if maybe it got fixed or something with this new patch. No? Okay. I thought maybe that the the patch they put in for the other thing kind of helped us out, but maybe not. So, we probably won't even need to go get the other one. We can probably uh, just sell these ones. In fact, we already have enough. I hate to say it, but uh, there might be enough between olive oil and that to actually pick up the Puma. And if we get the Puma, I am going to be extremely happy. Because we have been needing a large tractor or even, you know, a high-end uh, other one. Yeah, I wish we could just throw this stuff right up there without even having to uh, do it the hard way, but whatever, you know. Yeah, I think we're gonna, we might actually have enough for the Puma <laughs> and that. We may go back over and uh, load up the other load of, uh, of olive oil and... Uh, I mean, if we can get the hundred and whatever thousand, I'll take it, you know, because I'll... Uh, you know, I'd rather, personally, I'd rather have the tractor. If we gotta wait a little bit to do grapes, I don't care. <laughs> um, we're gonna be extremely close to being able to, we could buy the Puma without the motor upgrade. Let's put it that way. Right, probably right now. Um... Let's see purchase the Puma. If we just bought the motor upgrade... Oh, that's the wrong one. Wait. There. That's with the upgrade. We need 112. Let's run this back over. Because if we get this, this means we can get way better equipment. And I think it was 300 and some horsepower. Oops. Not going to run, don't really want to run over the picnic table, but don't care anymore. <laughs> uh, well, there's one little box left in there, but that ain't going to matter. We'll just, uh, we'll just get the rest of it. I'm going to kind of see if we can't put them right along the back of the, the car, because if we can back up to the train car, if we can drop them right in front of the train car. We may not even have to take the the hay or anything up yet. Um, let me see. I'm going to try and get in here so I don't accidentally get the bread. Even though the bread may be one of the other things that need to uh, go this month. Okay. Even with that, that might be enough right there, but let's see if there's any more olive oil in there waiting for us. Um, how much do we have in there? Outgoing products, olive oil. There's not enough, so. I'm actually surprised with as many olives but obviously that thing only gets, you know, doesn't run that fast. So uh, this might be, all we need is 6,000 and this might be close to 6,000. Or what could be even better is, it's over 9,000. Oh, okay. Now that I got my dumb, uh, Thing. I, I wouldn't be surprised if it's over 9,000. Okay, so we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna try backing up just out of curiosity. I'm gonna be annoyed if this works. It, you know, if it starts taking it out of the trailer or even gives me the eye. Okay, so it doesn't give me I, the eye thing, but it did let me do that, so, uh, okay, that's all we have is a couple. 
That's kind of funny. Ah! No! Okay. Come on. There we go. So, it stuck him up underneath the, the train car. Ah! No! <laughs> Get out of there! <laughs> And we definitely have enough for the tractor. I'm not even worried about the grapes right now. Because uh, I'd like to have the full thing with the tractor, but uh, if we have to wait on, on one upgrade, we will. Excellent. So, yeah, that was a, a good thing. Now, let's just make sure bread's not also able to be sold because if it can we'll go over and get that um where is bread right there um that's not bad uh no bread is december i, I knew i checked it um so let's go ahead and let's get our our puma this is gonna be so nice this is an awesome upgrade now can we 114. <laughs> Guess what, guys? We own a Puma. Woohoo! See, now we'll be able to get something like that later on. All right, so this is an awesome upgrade. No, that's correct. Okay. All right. So that worked out pretty good. I mean, other than I had one of them set to barley, um, it may screw things up. I don't know. There's those darn little ones again. Um, anyway, um, I'm almost tempted now to hook this other field together now that we got the, you know, the power. Anyway, um, yeah, let's take this over here. Um, I want to sleep because number one, I want to get rid of the rain. Number two, I want to, uh, turn my speed back up again I, I'm seriously I'm thinking about though doing this up with uh, together as one field but let's wait until we can actually get a decent uh, cultivator you know because cultivation is everything okay um, that wasn't a cultivator in there was it uh no, this is a planter. This is kind of thing we're going to replace uh, our thing with, but yeah. Let's go ahead and sleep. Now, there is, uh, I think the, the other stuff was, uh, was June, the stuff that we sold to get the, the vehicle. Um, Oh yeah, there we go. We're making some decent money now. I'm not going to complain. So, we need to do... Let's just see. What do we need to get done? I think what we're going to do is we're going to... Well, I was going to swap that out, but that thing you can handle that rock picker just fine. 
so pretty much this is probably going to be the last actual farm job that this thing's going to handle because uh, I don't think we really need to much. Um, I know I could have just tabbed over here, but uh, I wanted to drive over here. All right, so we're going to see how, how quick this gets done. I mean, this is a, almost 10 meters wide and but I'm thinking with this uh, low horsepower as this thing is, we might not get it done in that amount of time, you know, in a decent amount of time. Wait, what's going on? Oh, I guess you gotta turn it on too. That really does help. And we do, like I said, we do have enough horsepower to, to pull this thing, so. Man, this is so nice. Look, the rocks just disappeared. See, now I can, oops, I can kind of keep uh, overlapped. I don't know. Oh, okay, I'm getting pushed, so I'm going to disconnect. I kind of wondered if that might happen. So we're going to hook this up to this, because I know this will handle it. I was wondering why all of a sudden we started drifting across the field when I didn't turn. But, anyway... I mean, I'm really happy now. I mean, we got some real power. I mean, not, not monster power yet, but uh, still some real power. But, oh wow, this is so nice. <laughs> I know, you're going to hear me say that a few more times, so just get used to it. No, um, <laughs> I'll try to behave. Anyway, let's toss this in here. Um, now I know only this one and the other tractor can handle the, the other piece, so, uh, gonna have to just kind of um one of the two tractors let's grab let's actually take this tractor off here let's grab this tractor we'll bring the whole thing back over to the yard so now what was in june i know there was two things in june was it the eggs? Maybe. Um, let's see. Corn is when? June. Okay, so we're going to... We'll grab the big tractor when we're ready to do the corn. I, wait, um, let's actually look see where we can uh, take it. Um, looks like Farmer's Market is best for corn. So we'll do that later in the afternoon. But I'm going to take this over and stick it back where it was. I mean, we could pick up the cotton with it, but the cotton ain't for a while yet, so uh, I don't really want to use it for cotton. We'll put the cotton on the regular trailer. Because we're just a bunch of cotton pickers anyway. Oh. Woohoo, there's more here. Okay, so let's go grab that. Um, we'll bring, we'll hook the big tractor up to that when we're ready and uh, go from there. Yeah, we're gonna have to move cotton out pretty soon. It's getting full. I have a feeling this is just gonna become a utility tractor, you know, for dragging stuff around and uh, doing the other stuff. So let's see. So that field is going to have to be uh, cultivated next time. I, I knew we weren't going to get anywhere near everything done, you know, but uh, 
Man, I'm just, I'm ecstatic. Back down and finish whatever we need to get done. There's uh, the field across the way needs to be uh, cultivated. I'm hoping, I'm going to look here quick. I'm hoping there's a cultivator that we can buy. Okay. There we go. And since we brought the corn in on this trailer, we might as well take it out on this trailer. Uh, doing it differently, but... Uh, I mean, I wish we could get a bigger cultivator before, uh, before doing this field that we have to do. Okay, so we got 11 grand. That's not bad. So I just wanted to see... God, that'd be nice to have. Because then I, you know, that's the other thing we could put in there. Um, let's just take a quick look at stuff. Um, let's see. We could get our, our grape trailer. But I, I don't know if we need it right this minute, but I just want to look. Okay. So if we did sugar cane, um, that's a two row. I think no, that's a one row. That's two rows. You know, and of course we could get something like this to harvest it with. Um, and that, of course, will handle the sugar cane, but we can also do other things down the road with sugar cane, but that's beside the point. So, wait, what did I click on that, uh, that planted other stuff? Um, oh, that just hauls it, okay. And these, I, I, that's a planter. That's kind of cool. Um, okay, so let's just go into potatoes now. I just wanted to look at the stuff since we're finally making some money. I mean, obviously we can get a planter, no problem. It's one of these things that get to be expensive. Um, but, you know, you can get a look at some of the stuff out here and the, the grimy stuff. Um, you know, that'll do pretty good. Huh? Wait, that one does all of them? I don't know how that'd work with that, but... So I, I guess if we're going to look at one, we're going to look at this probably down the road if we get it. Because it's showing, I don't know why it's showing all the things, but maybe it would do uh, our other things that we want to do. Uh, I want to do, um, what do you call them, uh, turnips again, or sugar beets. Faster, but uh, I'm going to hook up to this and then I'm going to go grab the other uh, tractor and hook that up to it so that we know that it needs to be moved. Otherwise, I'll forget completely and then it'll be like, now where the heck did... Oh, I'm on the wrong side. I'll be, where the heck did I leave that Brantner trailer? <laughs> and you know it's true. Man, that's going to be cool. I mean, even if this is slow, it's still, you know, 100% worth it, you know, have, you know, going around with it. Um, I'm probably going to, at some point, uh, fill, like I said, fill in this waterway. I don't know if we're going to wait until next week when we're actually on and do it. 
Or if I should just do it quick now. I mean, we got enough money. It's not like it'd matter. Let's actually do that right now. Go here. Um, construction. Landscaping. Level. Let's turn that into a... Uh, We'll go, well, we don't need to go that big, uh, but we'll make this, we'll put the strength up so that works and then change it to that. Yeah, I kind of figured we were going to run into that whole situation, but that's fine. Okay, so... Now we're all nice and level here, can I? No, I can't get away with that. They got rid of some of the stuff over there, and I was like, well, can I get away with getting rid of that stuff? Um, but later on, we'll put some grass in here and stuff, but for right now, it's good. So, and it only cost us like 10 grand, you know, big deal. We'll make that back in new time now. So, let's see what we can get done here. I don't know how fast this is going to be. It might be, it might be blazing fast. Even you know, I don't know if this thing has like a a limit on it or not. All right, we're just about done here. I mean, it's not bad. I mean, it's still a little slow, but it does keep nine miles an hour the whole time. So that's a good thing. Um, what I'm thinking I want to do for next time, we're just, well, we may not do it next time. It may be, you know, a couple after that. But what I want to do is I want to look at... Uh, starting to get rid of stuff that's going on over there i want to get rid of uh of that uh multi-use uh factory but to do that we need to build three factories and i just want to look at how big each of those are so what i'd like to do is if we can push the factories over towards the field to the right the grass field over there we could extend this field and go from there. Um, so let's just quick look at that. Um, the production. Um, first one we're looking for is the mill. There's a bakery, but I think that's a big one. There's a grain mill, but there, I think there's a smaller one. Probably right around the same size or money, you know, money amount, but. Uh, there's the oil mill. The oil mill is, uh, yeah. So, if that, if we could keep within that, you know, we could actually put it back here a little ways. So it'd be, you know, like there. Um, what is this? This is grapes. There's like a small bakery. We could do something like that very easily. Okay, and then the other one is the mill. That's nothing that we need. Um, let's 
So I don't know if we've actually got another mill in here. I might not. Um, I know we got so many different things here. I mean, I'd like to do something like this too, you know. But we need propane for that, so. I'm just looking to see if we do have another, uh, that's a beet pulp. Now, there's so many different things that I have. There's the grain mill. Okay, so that's not that big either. I mean, they're expensive, but they're not monstrous, you know. So we could get away with putting them on here and then, uh, you know, bringing this field out to this side and going from there. So um, that was just something I wanted to look at, you know, for next time. Like I said, I think what we're going to do then is we'll kind of guesstimate where it needs to be. And then we'll draw a line down the side, you know, we'll come down and then we'll start going back here and add to this field. But uh, I think that's probably all we're going to get done today without, uh, you know, having some uh, massive jump cuts and stuff in there. And uh, I don't, I'm trying to stay under um, three time lapses and we're right at three. So. I mean, there may be a time where all the equipment is so big that we got to do more time lapses, but uh, yeah, we got plenty of work for next time. We're probably going to get that field done. We might not do the rocks on this field, but we're going to get that field planted. The one, um, the one on the left anyway, and then the one on the right, we're going to try and get done as well. But I'm hoping maybe we can do like... Uh, yeah, well, that one's going to have to be um, cultivated first, but yeah. Um, and then the, the far right one, we're going to do, uh, we're going to have to put uh, lime down on that field as well. So uh, that's kind of the plan for next time. So uh, I guess we'll see you guys uh, next week when we do this again. And uh, it'll be kind of fun, you know, by then we'll, by then you guys will already seen at least one episode of Silver Run Forest, the plot part of the platinum edition so uh can't wait for that so i will see you guys next time